Welcome to the new hybrid online forensic science class for the spring of 2014. This video is being made to kind of explain what we're going to be doing with our two classes over the next semester. We're going to actually have two different classes, an online hybrid class and a traditional classroom. But in the traditional classroom, we'll be flipping the class. Flipping means you'll be getting most of the basic information outside of the class via video, video and other methods. Class time will be used for discussion and activities. Um, content will be conveyed via short videos. Activities can be done either online or in class. Textbook and other information sources we will be using. Uh, there won't be any entrance exams anymore or entrance surveys, but there will be exit surveys of two different types. Multiple choice of the facts type. These can be taken online at home or in, in class. The other type are written, non google answers type questions, and they can also be taken at home, but they're going to be more thoughtful, and you're going to have to make a little effort to answer them correctly. We're going to have discussion forums for the online class. Those will be online through Schoology, and in the face-to-face -face classroom, we'll be talking in class. Um, we're also going to have many other new activities and tasks. We're going to be using lots of different resources. Um, outside of the regular website, and you'll see that as we start uh, the firearms unit. Our learning platform is, is going to be Schoology, and all of you have an account already, but everything will still be mirrored on LiveBinders, the forensic science page of learn.davidprindle.com, and there are mobile versions of all of this, and if you go to learndavidprindle.com, you can see this. Um, right here. Um, I've put a mobile apps for my class page and you can see there apps right there for Android and iOS devices as soon as it pops up here. Um, Schoology for iPhone and iPad, Android, Live Binders for iPhone and iPad, uh, WordPress with this is the type of blog this is or website and they're, they're all there. Um, Twitter apps are there and we'll talk about those in a second but you can see that um, we're going to still have the class live binder it'll change a little bit maybe to reflect how we're doing the class and for labs we're going to be using class journals and now back to the presentation we're still going to use your Google folder so that you're still going to be using that to save work into and that's where I'll pull it all from um, class meeting days, the majority of the online class obviously will be online. Um, labs will usually take place on Wednesday. Um, check class announcements at the beginning of the week or all through the week if you can to see what's going on. Fridays occasionally will also be used for material that can't be offered online, so also again check the announcements. However, you may want to attend class any day or you need to or you want to. You, there's no reason you don't have to do online continuously. And for those of you in the traditional class, if you need to miss, you're not going to miss anything because it's going to be all online and you're going to still have access to everything 6th hour does. Um, lab experiences will be scheduled at least one week in advance. They are required for you to be to attend at the high school. and. Most times they'll be one day long, some are going to be two days, some three days, and maybe even longer, but they're going to be spaced out, and they will be scheduled well in advance so you know what's going on. So make sure you always check the class announcements. And labs, again, will be turned in via classjournals.com. We are going to, or I am going to use Twitter and Facebook. I'm going to mirror stuff on there. These are not required. You're not required to have a Facebook, or you're not required to have a Twitter. But if you want to follow us on Twitter, it's at BCHS Forensic Sci. We're going to be using the hashtag BCHSFS. Um, I, I'm going to tweet out when I put stuff on, on Schoology, and I tweet out when there's snow days or anything, or an example, uh, and you're all interested, most of you are interested in Sherlock. That will start again on Sunday at 8 o'clock on W or 10 o'clock on WGVSU channel 35. So stuff like that. So if you want to follow us on Twitter, you can at BCHS Forensic Sci. Some final notes: It's not a, a race to see how fast you can get finished with the class. You need to do quality work, but move at a steady pace. 
don't get behind though you're still going to have to meet benchmarks at the quarter and at the end of the semester and if you are one of the online students and have permission to leave sixth hour I talked to Mr. Joseph and you have to check out in the office each time one more thing this is brand new endeavor and a pilot and the concept will be changed we're going to be doing this on the fly in most cases I'm going to try to plan out each unit but sometimes changes may be needed and well sometimes they won't even notice them other times it may be a total rework of something and so you need to be kept abreast of that and if there's a major change I'll explain to you why the change is needed and how it will affect you and we're also looking for your input if you have some questions or anything or have an idea of a way to do th something better just email me and that will help us all um, we are being watched um, your parents are watching if they want to they can get parent access codes for the um, Schoology class but everything's still mirrored on open sites like the live binder and um, the website if they still want that code they can email me at dprindle at bcp s bcp k b uh, sorry about that dprindle at bcps k12 dot net um, there's a person that you don't know his name is Mr. John Carippo he's a friend of mine in California he's going to be helping with the structure of the class not the content and um, he is listed as an instructor on the class but you won't ever see anything by him unless he um, wants to put forth um, himself but he's here to help Mr. Joseph, Mr. Lake will be watching and other people in my professional learning network via Twitter are very interested in how what's going on so you will be being watched and I will have a lot of help during this time and then you can find this presentation on Schoology the website and the class live binder and if you want to when you go over to those sites if you click here there's a video that will kind of represent what we will be doing so thanks for listening. You can show this to your parents if you want. And we'll be starting Tuesday, January 21st. See you then.